Good day everyone, thank you for this opportunity for me to present this third international conference on tourism, technology and business management and I would like to present a proposal for attendance system based on face recognition in Kuching Community College, Malaysia. So this, this proposal is uh, proposed by myself, Luke Kenny Doring from College Community Kuching together with Ku Muhammad Azri bin Ku Azizan from College Community Jerai and also Nur Shafiza binti Zakaria from College Community Kuching. So in the current scenario, uh, students' attendance recording plays an important role in improving the quality of education system. Uh, attendance record should have the details of the information about the start time, the date and also the venue. So in those days, uh, or even uh, before this, uh, the manual uh, labor, including the maintenance and the management of the traditional method of taking attendance, for example, the attendance sheets, is very tedious and it costs quite a time, even for the lecturers and also for those who manages an event or a meeting. The efficiency of attendance check by manual record is not always satisfying and it is really a headache to the whole education field. So let's get on the proposal background for attendance system based on face recognition in college community coaching. The face, so face recognition is one of the biometric that has potential to replace conventional approaches for attendance management system. It is capable of migrating the manual or conventional base attendance system to a more contactless uh, registration where it will benefit organizations meeting, event or classroom attendance in education. The conventional approaches have been identified a tedious uh, process where it requires a lot of manual input, self sign, pass over attendance sheets, beside it is always uh, believed to be fraudulent and there's a, there's a question or there's an issue of question of authenticity. So not only that, uh, the whole uh, conventional approaches is believed to be costly and time consuming for documenting attendance sheets. With the current pandemic uh, registered into problems recently, is the requirement for safety measures in preventing COVID-19 transmission. It requires contactless registration for attending function or even entering classroom and premises. This paper is proposed to attend, uh, to propose an attendance system using face recognition in College Community Coaching to address the issue of manual conventional system and contactless attendance management system. It is coupled with a face mask detection. The system plans to record the length of time an attendee spent in the lecture, where the attendee's face recording will be timestamped and stored in the database. So in this part, let's look at the problem statement. Most organization is facing the same issue, which it replace, uh, which is to replace the conventional attendance system to a more automatic and real-time attendance system. The software and the hardware are very pricely in the marketplace and it costs highly for modification to suit organizations need. There's also a need for a lightweight system that can be run in ready own hardware such as laptop and video camera for a more cost saving setup. So for this uh, proposal, the objective of this system is to propose an attendance system using a face recognition in Kuching Community College in Malaysia to address the issue of manual conventional system and also a contactless attendance management system. And it is hope that it will bring uh, this study uh, will contribute to a face recognition based attendance system that can, can be implemented in the education sector with an embedded mass detection due to the current pandemic situation. So let's get to the related work on attendance system. Many phase recognition based algorithm for attendance management has been proposed, such as student attendance monitoring by Maltida and Shahin 2019, classroom attendance based on video phase recognition by Lin and Lee 2019, attendance monitoring system for classroom environment 
Bachaharia Naila Rotri, 2018, Kao Wang and Wang, 2018, Ping Dapeng and Zuin, 2018, and Real Time Attendance Marking System by Zin, Zi and Wang, Gao and Xin, 2018, and also Shao Shao He Shao Ni, Kat. Kaka, Jain, Singh, and Garg, 2018. The common face recognition system consists of three main parts and are pre-processing. There are pre-processing, the feature selection and classification. According to Kotli, 2020, the three main parts can be details for face recognition structure, which consists of face detection, the feature extraction, and also face recognition. There are three phase main recognition algorithm accessible to use, such as Viola Cohn Jones algorithm and Eigen phase algorithm. Li Blanc 2005, Godem and Ramesh 2016, Yang Sung Ring and Huang 2016. Balti, Car and Jen 2014 developed an automatic attendance recording system with 95% accuracy in detecting and recognizing frontal phase orientation. For detailed process, Matilda and Shahin 2019 proposed a student attendance monitoring system using image processing for economical and time saving setup. So it consists of a camera and goes into an image containing faces in the database where internal resize with processing. From there, it will draw up a line edge mapping and face identification and face extraction will be carried out and will be sampled out with the safe template in database. When it match with the template in database, it will generate the attendance. When it goes under the line edge mapping, it falls in the face selection region and it will also display the uh, in the attendance in the application that this process has been carried out. So we come up with our proposal for the system where we take other system uh, approaches in other system or related work uh, as a reference. For example, the one that has been done by Matilda and Shahin 2019. And we come up with an approach that consists of face detection mass detection, face recognition, and attendance recording. So the proposal is as, the framework of the proposal is as the following, as in figure two, where the image cam entry at the starting point, the image is captured with a video camera and, and, edit, and it will be placed at the entry door. And another one will be placed at the exit door. Both of these will function as entry and exit. So it goes into the face detection. So it will detect the face of this individual, the attendees, using a cascade cassette flyer algorithm by Viola and Jones, 2001. And it goes into the next phase that is the mass detection. The face mass detection are performed before face recognition. So the system uses a uh, train mass cascade cassette classifier to detect if attendees are wearing face masks. The trained mask of Renault 2020 can be adapted for embedded uh, to be embedded in the system. Then we go into the next part that is the face recognition. So the face recognition for attendees is performed uh, to recognize by comparing the face uh, database using either local binary patterns histogram LBPH, Eigen Face or Fisher Algorithm Administrator. That we will choose either one uh, to predict the input phase. So for this system, the internal database was chosen for simplicity and safe uh, cost saving. And last part that is the attendance recording. So the time of the recognition image that match to the safe database is recorded. The recognition is based on the threshold set by the, at the administration. So the calculation is made from the time span in the event by deduct, deducting the entry and the exit captured time. So the output file 
uh, generated for each recognition will be saved uh, as attendance record and the time spent in each event will be calculated and return the result in minute and hour between these two files. So for the system development it requires two parts. The first one is the preparation for the hardware and also uh, the software. The hardware requires two cameras. One camera will be placed at the entry, the other one will be replaced at the exit. So it will be um, controlled with a laptop. And the software, the programming required to carry out uh, to execute the task for each stage is de described in, uh, in the photo here. We, we, we use fight Python or OpenCV uh, and use for the internal database for storage. So the final uh, part of the system development, we will get an output from the data collected. So the final output of the attendance system based on the recognition and the timestamp, uh, we can calculate the time spent by the attendee in the classroom or even in the event. So you will get uh, details of the time log where uh, you know when do they get in, when do they get out, and also the time engagement for each individual uh, identified by their own name in the attendance system output. So in conclusion, we expect with the proposal of this student's attendance system, it will emerge as an attractive solution to tracking students' attendance and improve the current process of students' attendance recording. And we hope this system will benefit the education sector in storing and retrieving students' attendance data. Thank you so much for listening to my presentation. Uh, I wish you all a good day. Thank you.